Okay, so I have uh, finally got to a fairly decent point on the level builder, although the level I have built is incredibly bad. Uh, and I'm just going to show a little bit of the progress on Dot tonight. So let me jump in there. Good. All right, so you can see there's not much to this level. It's a big open space with uh, some... Oh, my... Sorry, my headphones were a little caught there. Oh, bugger all. I wanted music. All right, we got a little bit of a bass line of music there. Now, this is some of the music that Dave uh, Barnett has created uh, for the... Is it Dave or David? I think he likes to call it David. Daviad. All right. All right, so uh, I've got a little bit of music going here. That's uh, by David Barnett. He's doing uh, the music for the game. Uh, this track is called Terminus Lockdown. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to show off a little bit of what's going on in the game right now. So I'm just going to pop on the headset so you can see. Uh, now you're going to be seeing it in double vision probably, but um, whoa, I just turned. There we go. So whoa. what is doing that? That was weird. Okay. <laughs> So anyway, um, yeah, uh, there's not much to the level right now because I'm playing with the new level builder, uh, but it does support adding, um, I can actually add areas with no floor so we can have treacherous pits and all that sort of fun stuff. And as you can see, it now supports multiple zones and uh, the player who you can see below me there, that's my little guy jumping up and down. I'm a little off center on my camera here. That'll be fixed. But uh, yeah, as you can see, it supports multiple zones and those zones will actually, you'll be able to launch bombs like this bomb over here. Uh, all assets subject to change, of course, but you'll be able to launch a bomb like this bomb um, and it'll blow up the walls. There's also the dash power, which is somewhat working. There we go, so you can see. And then after a couple seconds, those light up, and you can actually collect them. Though they don't make the common sound. Oh, yeah. I love this. You can get so close to them. They have a nice little glow effect to them there. Positional tracking's working, so you will be able to look around corners a little bit. Uh, yeah, so you'll be able to see other players who are up there and fire bombs at them and they'll be able to see you from there. Of course, their up will be different from your up and uh, the levels uh, I've got... Uh, um, we're going to be working on a lot of stuff for uh, Tech Life this year and I think that the demo is... I'm feeling a lot of pressure, but I'm feeling a lot better now that I have the level builder working a bit better. Um, That's weird. I thought I had enough dots to do this, but I guess I don't. Well, oh well. I thought I could bash more than one wall for you. And there is the void. And there is a corner. Anyway, so yeah. Uh, it doesn't look like much right now, but it's taken a lot of work to get to this point. And uh, once you start seeing the levels built in, it's going to be a lot more impressive. We're going to have a lot more fun. And... Uh, yeah, I hope that uh, if you're in Edmonton, I hope to see you at Tech Life this year because uh, I'm going to have a multiple stations set up so that people will be able to play um, at least two player and hopefully up to four player, depending on how much hardware I can get my hands on. <laughs> so, yeah, thanks for watching. Oh, yeah. Where are my glasses at?